and welcome to another video. I thought I would do a little bit of filming outside today because it's just stopped raining. So, <laughs> beautiful British summertime that we're having. It's been raining most of the day and a um, little bit of chill in the air. So I thought I'd do a week of summer outfits. Ha ha, bearing in mind the weather. Um, but that has not deterred me today. I, I have got a cardigan on, but I've got a summer dress on. It was so miserable, it's Monday today, and it was so miserable and so just dark and grey and unsummer-like this morning that I wanted to wear something bright and colourful. I really do find that wearing something bright and colourful just uplifts my mood completely. I will, of course, put links in for anything that I can do, although a lot of what I'm wearing this week will probably be older, no longer in stock. So. Um, uh, I'll, I'll do my best anyway. I'll try and put comparables in or something um, if I can't find the exact things. Things right. Let me position you so you can. See. So from the bottom up today, I have on my JD Williams trainers. That I don't know if you can see them. Actually, are they in shot? Are they in shot? I think they are just about. Um, which I bought beginning of this year from Simply Be their Wide Fit and they are so so comfortable I paid a little bit more than I would normally pay for a pair of wide trainers for the summer but they're leather and I'm glad I did because they're super comfortable and they are wearing really well considering how often I wear them also just got to take them off so I can show you this little fact you don't have to undo the laces to do them up I've got elasticated laces in them anyway but um got a little zip down here which is just brilliant I love that I know that a lot of you have bought these already I can see when you use my links what you buy and um, yeah I know that a lot of you have bought these so I hope that you're finding them as comfortable and useful as I am this summer right next I have this little smock dress on I love the print I love the colors the sort of green and green turquoise maybe aqua turquoise I'm going for turquoise turquoise and bright pink it's a little short sleeve sort of tiered smock dress so comfortable so loose and um, it's got a tiny bit of stretch in the material but it's sort of slippy rather than jersey and this came from TikTok shop from a brand called Elatino Curve I think they've got their own website as well so if I can find it I will link it but um, I'm not sure I can't do TikTok shop links I'm not that techy and then over the top because it's too cold to be wearing a summer dress with no cardigan today I've just got this cream coloured I think this is a loungewear cardigan from Primark which is soft and sloppy and um, fairly lightweight but quite nice and warm and goes with almost anything doesn't it this colour so that is Monday's summertime outfit without the summertime weather to match welcome to Tuesday and to day two of um, outfits of the week as you can see we've got some sunshine today which is nice hasn't been like this all day I'm filming this at about half past four in the afternoon but um, it hasn't been like this all day but we will take the sunshine while we can get it so I've um put you the other way around today so that I can um, be in the shade rather than get too much glare when I do the full length shot I'm hoping you can see my feet in there can you I think so yes today from the bottom upwards I've got my little Vivea nude ballet pumps on love Vivea shoes they've sent me several pairs of shoes in the past and I've shown them to you. I think I got a discount code with them so I will put that in the description box if I can find it. So, so comfortable their shoes and sustainable and eco-friendly as well. Win, win, win. Um, I've got my M&S Harper jeans with the turn-ups on. I've talked about these many times. They're so comfortable. The fit is just really good for me. I get the short version. Short, I can't never remember if it's short or petite. I think it's short. But they just fit really well they sit nicely on my waist they're not too tight they don't dig in they're quite nice lightweight stretch denim highly recommend i think they're still available in this particular one with the turn up so i will link them obviously and then i've got this purple linen tun linen tunic from pure plus which was gifted for a haul um lovely quality linen so comfortable loose fit nice three-quarter sleeve um 
just a lovely colour, all the nice things. I think I've got a discount code with Pure Plus as well, so I'll pop that in the description box as well. Love their linen items. Um, and then I've got little earrings, which you may already have seen, little hearts, which I got from a little boutique locally several years ago. I don't wear them very often but when I do I always think I should wear them more often because I really like them and that is Tuesday's outfit I just want to take a little moment out of today's video to thank today's sponsor which is a company you may not have heard of because I hadn't heard of them till they contacted me Daisy Silk they make the most exquisite silk clothing and I think they do sheets and things as well, which is lovely bedding. They got in touch and asked if I'd like to work with them and I said, yes, absolutely. And I've got some of their beautiful, beautiful clothing items to show you. They use the finest quality mulberry silk and you can definitely feel the quality of it when you first open the garments. They are honestly just absolutely beautiful. They arrive beautifully presented in boxes and folded inside boxes with tissue paper. And this is the first item that I chose. This is honestly, the feeling of the silk is just so beautiful. The color ranges are also amazing. They've got so many beautiful colors. I've got three things in different colors to show you. This is the first item. It's almost like a, a chemise, I think we're gonna call it. I was gonna say a nighty, but that doesn't really give it its full, um, you know, gravitas. It's such a beautiful item feeling of it is so lovely i think we'll call it a chemise it's got a three-quarter sleeve and a v-neck and it sort of sits just above knee length i think it is and it just feels lovely it's so lovely to wear just absolutely beautiful the next item i chose was this beautiful blouse with this little button detail here look on the v-neck love this color this i don't know if it's coming off so perfectly on camera it's like a i call it a light sage green again the quality is just amazing it's got the matching buttons on the cuffs there it's beautifully made it feels so lovely there's there's silk and then there's silk isn't there and um, daisy silk was born out of um the founder marguerite had issues with skin sensitivity and she wanted to and create garments that were good for people who had either allergies to certain fabrics or were perfect for skin sensitivity and I have to say the feeling of these when they're on although I don't have sensitive skin just beautiful should mention as well I need to read this bit to you so I get it right um they the all daisy silk products are certified by Ocatex which is an internationally internationally recognized certification that ensures that textiles and textile products are free from harmful substances and have been tested for their safety and sustainability throughout the production process finally what could be snazzier than silk pajamas these just feel like the most luxurious garment i love this sort of pale teal blue color with the white trim and it's got a little, I don't know if you can see on the bottom of the trousers there, the scalloped, am I showing you that? It's got the scalloped hem around the bottom of the top as well, but also on the bottom of the trousers, I'm not showing you that too well, am I? Also on the bottom of the trousers there, the matching scalloped hem, which is a lovely touch. So if you're interested in trying anything from Daisy Silk, I do have a uh, discount code and I'll put all the links and discount code and info down in the description box and also in the pinned comment at the top of the comment section. So um, thank you again to Daisy Silk for sponsoring this part of today's video. Good morning, good morning. It is Wednesday. It is another day that, let's be honest, it's not sunny. Sorry, I thought there was someone behind me in the car. It's not. it's not sunny. It's due to rain later. And it's a bit bloody cold as well. However, I have got a summer dress on. I'm determined to get my wear out of my summer dresses this year. So let me show you what I've got on. And then I can put my cardigan back on over the top of it. So today I have got on this little star print dress from Ritera. I have... It's, Sorry, there's lots of very distractive things. That was a butterfly. I think it's a very chilly butterfly. Um, yeah, this is from Ritera. I did a haul with them a while ago. I think I've got a discount code with them, so I'll put that in the description box. 
Um, I like the length of this one, it's a little bit longer. It's got an elasticated waist as well, which I think gives me a bit of shape, which is good. I like the sort of tiered skirt, nice and loose and floaty, perfect for summer. V-neck, which I like, I feel it's elongating on us shorter ladies. And it's got a little frill around the sleeve. I very much like the little star print. Now I've shown you that, I'm gonna bug my cardigan back on. My Primark Cardi. <laughs> which has got more wear than I would have liked it to have done this summer. Um, I've also got on today little pink earrings from Primark, which I think are really pretty. I really like these. Um, I got them a couple of years ago, so they're not current season, but um, I do like them. And then I've got my trainers on from JD Williams again, which I talked about on Monday, so I won't talk about those any further today. But yeah, I'm making a big effort to not go down the jeans and sort of, making these videos is pretty good actually because it makes you not go down the normal jeans and jumper, jeans and sweatshirt route that I might be doing were it not for making these videos. I'm pulling things out of my wardrobe that I've not worn for a while and um, yeah, just getting wear out of what I have and reminding myself what I have. Sometimes when you have a lot of clothes, which I do, you kind of forget what you've got, do you know what I mean? And uh, I'm never gonna be a capsule wardrobe person, but I'd certainly like to be somebody who um, gets plenty of wear out of all their clothes, so that's what I'm working towards. <laughs> anyway, that's Wednesday's outfit. I'll be back in the morning with Thursday's outfit. Good morning, good morning. It is a miserable, wintry, cold day. Who knew I would be saying this almost every day when I did an Outfits of the Week in the middle of the summer? But it is what it is. I've reverted to actual winter clothes today. I have drawn the line at putting my boots on, although it is quite wet outside. But I'm going out today and um, I wanted to wear something that would keep me warm because it's miserable and damp and horrible out there. So this is today's outfit. I have got on these jeans that are sort of skinny jeans. They're from Marks & Spencer. Um, they've got a little bit of diamond, diamante embellishment on the pockets, although I always wear my tops over the top so you can't see that. They're actually from a charity shop and they're super comfortable, really, really nice. Um, the top I've got on is a little leopard print, le leopard print print, a leopard print top sort of a tunic style top this is from Evans a couple of years ago um I've had it in my wardrobe as I say for a couple of years and I haven't really worn it much but um I, I feel like it's a little bit on the long side for me but it's got a nice three-quarter sleeve and the fabric is so it's sort of jersey but it's slightly a bit warmer than jersey so I feel like it's a good option for today because I think we got down as far as seven degrees so that was nice um centigrade that is not Fahrenheit obviously <laughs> Um, and then on my feet I've got little ballet pumps from Next. I'm going to actually link these if there's, obviously I'm linking everything that's still available, but these, I don't think I've talked to you about these before. I have wide feet and sometimes when you, I, li I like a ballet pump, but very often ballet pumps can exacerbate one's wide feet, make them look even wider. I really like these because these go in at the top. Now, now I'm saying all this, I feel like I have talked about these before, so excuse me if I have menopause brain, who knows what I've talked about. Um, yeah, the, these narrow towards the toe, which makes them a really nice shape. They are leather and they are wide fit and they're super comfy. Um, I think next do these all the time, just looking to see. It's the Forever Comfort range, so if they have, are in stock, I will link them in the description box. Um, for you because as I say comfortable and they make your feet look a little bit narrower rather than exacerbating the width so that's Thursday's outfit oh I haven't done jewellery I've got a little necklace from Anna Louisa a little fine gold necklace chain there and then these earrings which I think are from Primark I think all my earrings are from Primark they're not actually but um, I wear a lot of earrings from Primark these came in a set of three pairs with silver rose gold and gold obviously all coloured metal not 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 actual silver and gold right that's Thursday's outfit I'll see you again tomorrow welcome to Friday not raining at the moment but too windy to film outside unfortunately it will muffle the sound so today so i'm just putting you a little bit further away so i can go backwards and show you what i'm wearing today it might be 
two for the price of one today. I haven't angled that particularly well. Yeah, it might be two for the price of one today because I'm at home all day just working. So I've got something very comfy and not necessarily an outfit that I wear to leave the house um, on today. But we're going out this evening, so there'll probably be a Brucey bonus outfit today um, later on. So at the moment I've got on um, this gorgeous turquoise aqua coloured very loose fit lagen looky top with pockets from Pure Plus who I mentioned earlier in the week. I've got a discount code with them. I'll pop it in the description box. Um, I've got this skirt which was from two at Sainsbury's a couple of years ago. It's just a jersey sort of maxi skirt which I love the leopard print. Not sure it necessarily goes with this top but they were the first things that came to hand out of the wardrobe. It's a, it's a very non-outfits of the week outfit of the week today and then I've just got my little Vivea pumps on for comfort. Um, as I said just a worky day at home. I have got some earrings on. I've got these earrings which I've had for years and I couldn't tell you where they're from but um, I got these sort of acrylic bits in the big middle with marbly bits on which I rather like. So um, yeah, that is Friday's daytime outfit. I'll be back later with Friday's evening outfit. Still Friday, second outfit of Friday. We are off out for the evening. As I mentioned earlier, we're only going, only going to Weatherspoons for a couple of drinks and then for a curry with friends. Um, so, and we're probably gonna walk down to town. So I've got sensible, sort of everyday clothes on really. Ashley's got one of his flashy shirts. I'll get him to show you it if he's, I think he's coming in this direction. Do you want to come and do your shirt of the evening? Don't know if you've seen this one before. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we didn't quite see it. Uh, Aeroplanes. Spitfires, Wellingtons, Hurricanes. Very vintage. Yes. Thank you. You may go now. <laughs> Right, and I am wearing, have I got you at the right angle? Yes, my white trainers, which we've seen a lot this week. My same blue jeans that were Marks and Spencer's via a charity shop because it's not very nice outside, doesn't feel very summery. And then I've got this kimono top with a sort of tiny leopard print on it and a black vest top underneath that, both from New Look, but last year. So not, not yeah. Yeah, I don't need to explain last year, do I? You already know what last year means. <laughs> so no longer in stock. Um, right, I've got a glass of wine over there that's just been poured for me, so I'm going to go and drink that. Wishing everybody else a very pleasant Friday night, although by the time you see this, it will be next week. So, um, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. It's Saturday, and it doesn't get any realer than this. This is what I'm wearing today, so far. Um... I might get changed a bit later, but it might only be into pyjamas. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry, I've just had a glass of water and it went down the wrong way. My hair's up in a ponytail. I've got my same Pure Plus turquoise top on that I had on the other day. Um, I've got my llama leggings, the swirly, brightly coloured ones. Um, I have a discount code for them. I will put the, that down there. Um, and my Vionic trainers. I'm loving my Vionic trainers. Um, I decided to, I've got a bit of a story, so I'll just readjust you there. I've worn Skechers trainers for the last, oh, five or six or seven years, maybe. And I noticed that when I was wearing them, I may have told you this already, that my right foot was turning inwards and I looked into supportive trainers, more supportive trainers. And it turns out that podiatrists don't really recommend Skechers because although they're super comfy, they are not very supportive. So I did some research into it and I looked into the best thing with arch support and... Um, I got Vionic trainers, they're very expensive, but I got them 40 quid, brand new on eBay. So I was pleased about that because I didn't want to spend all that money without trying them first, you know. So it's going to be over £100, I think, or around £100. But I absolutely love them, they're so, so good. Um, definitely more supportive, still comfortable, not quite as comfortable as Skechers, but they're comfortable, I can wear them all day, no problem. Anyway, as I said, today's Saturday, it's the day of pottering about around the house today a bit of cleaning bit of tidying bit of sorting and organizing and that's all i've got planned really possibly a uh, little marathon 
session of succession this afternoon because I'm just about to start so season four so I've got ten episodes to go of that. This was meant to be Outfits of the Week, not randomly chat to the camera for ages, Caroline. <laughs> so um, that's Saturday's outfit. <laughs> Good morning, it is Sunday. We have reached the end of the week. <laughs> I wish I could say that the weather had improved, but it's damp, it's cloudy, it's dark, it's not even very warm. In fact, hilariously, I'm not wearing what I was intending to wear today. I did a cheeky little Yours Clothing sale order. I saw I haven't ordered from Yours Clothing for ages because of the fit issues and the length of everything. And just, I find their sizing really difficult. Um, although I like a lot of what they sell, it's just the sizing and it's all over the place and things are so long. But um, I tried on this top that arrived from Yours Clothing yesterday. And I bought it with autumn winter in mind, really, um, because it's got that sort, it's that sort of brushed, just like, like it's quite thin but it's slightly brushed for it feels quite warm you know and um, i felt so nice and warm and snug in it that i decided to keep it on for the day even though it's very it's not very summery in um either colors or fabric but there we go anyway let me show you what i'm wearing today same trainers white trainers from simply b then i've got my Marks and spencer harper jeans on but the newer ones the sort of aqua colored ones without the turn-ups We've already talked about the Harper jeans and how much I love them in this video, so um, don't need to go on and on about those. And this is the Yours Clothing Top. Now, as you can see, it's a very oversized one. I got this two sizes down because of the size, the, the sort of the style of it. I thought I'm not going to order that in my normal size, so I've ordered it in an 18. This is an 18, so you can see how oversized it is. And yes, it does have the length issue. Again, it's sort of almost down on my knees i would rather it was shorter really however i thought i could almost wear this as a dress with leggings and knee-high boots in the winter um not quite a dress but getting on that way you know so um, i'm quite pleased with the top anyway i've got four bits from yours clothing and of the four i am sending two back and keeping two this is one of the ones i'm keeping obviously um so that brings us to the end of the week i'm going to go and edit this and um try and get it up today for you um and yeah i hope you've enjoyed it i'll link everything that i possibly can or dupes or whatever in the description box and if you can't find the description box i will repeat that information at the top of the comment section so if you go down to the comment section scroll right to the top it will be there for you as well thank you for watching i hope you've enjoyed this i'll see you again in the next one Bye bye